Today, we are going to be answering the question that has weighed upon all of our minds for years. Who is Bellum Total? Alright, so, in Bellum Total's 10,000 subscriber special video, he said that one of these people is him. We're going to go ahead, we're going to find out which one it is, using my amazing detective skills. Uh, let's start with this guy. He's got, he's got a mustache, and I, I could see Bellum with a mustache. The glasses are pretty, pretty dope, I'll admit. I don't know who this man is, but I'm gonna... It's not decided, but I'm gonna circle him. That's a possibility. This is Rhett from Rhett and Link. He does have a very Bellum complexion about him, but I'm gonna go with no. It's, uh, it's too obvious. It's not, uh... Donald Trump! Donald Trump. See, Bellum does have a very Trump way about him. With the, uh, I could imagine a comb over. Comb over is possible with Bellum. But, the problem is that, uh, that Bellum has made fun of Trump in the past. Is that a cover? These are the questions you gotta ask. I'm gonna go with no. I'm gonna go with no. I don't think Bellum is Trump. It's, uh, it's a little too, uh, it's like they're playing off of it. You, you gotta find the person you most medium suspect. You, you can't suspect it high, you can't suspect it low. It's medium suspect. Diplex heated, ew, no. Um, Pudipai! Um, Pudipai. Could be Pudipai. But, uh, again, the beard. I think, I think Bellum could potentially have the beard going on. But, uh,. I don't know. Bellum does have a, uh, a blatant distaste for the Swedes. The Swedish. So I'm going to go with no. I don't know who this guy is, but he is... God damn it, he is handsome. Oh, it's too handsome for Bellum's voice. I'm going to go with no. That's a negatory. This is, uh, this is Link from Rhett and Link. Or did I get those backwards? No, that's Link. Um, I'm going to go with no. Same reasons as for Rhett... No idea who this guy is, but he's got the Spock sign going on. I'm going to give that a circle. It's potential. It's got potential. No idea who this guy is, but the Superman. You can't... Mm, Bellum's no Superman. Like, lover, I think. I don't know. But I'm going to go with no. This guy looks like Harry Potter. Hmm. Perhaps this is Daniel Radcliffe. Bellum, Bellum has been a fanboy of Daniel Radcliffe for a very long time, so he might just put this in here to, to throw us off the trail and be like, hey, I'm Daniel Radcliffe. But, I'm going to go with a no. Barack Obama. Uh, the accents just don't match. They don't match. Unless, wait. Let's get our eraser tool out. Fuck, I just erased Bellum, or uh, potentially Bellum's face, or Obama's face. That's a sign. It's not a Barack Obama. I was going to go back on it and say maybe Obama's been doing an accent this whole time. Obama. But, um, it's a, it's a pretty hard thing to upkeep. Let's see this guy down here. I don't, I don't know who he is, but he's got that smug, the smug going. Hmm. Bellum's not that smug. I'm going to go with a no. Negatory. Don't know who this guy is, but he's got the beard and he's got the, the eyebrows. One up, one down. 1988. That could be his birth year, but Bellum was born the same year I was. I'm going to go with a negatory, because you only wear a number on your shirt if it's your birthday. Merca player. I'm going to go with no. Just nah. No. No. Possibly. I could peg Bellum for a glasses wearer. This is possible. This is possible. Mark Hamill. Mark Hamill. This is a this is a peculiar one. It has potential. Bellum has been a known Star Wars lover. We're gonna square him because that's a that's a pretty big big guess. Don't know who this guy is, but it looks like an officially taken photo, and I I don't think that's Bellum. This guy. Whew. That has potential. That has potential. I'm going to circle it. This guy also has potential. Circle it. This man, I have no idea who he is, but nope. All right. 
This leaves us with one, two, three, four, five, six potential people. Let's see. Let's uncover the mystery of Bellum Total. Spock. I haven't heard Bellum speak much of Spock, but I could see him being a Star Trek lover, an advocate for the show. But I'm going to go with no. i got to go with my gut. This man here. The face is too narrow. Too, too goddamn narrow. That leaves us with three. And let's start with the guy on the far right. The picture is just blurry enough to be a homebrew. The frizzy hair, I could see the frizzy hair. It has potential. I'm gonna have to go with no though. Because the guy on the left looks like it could be Bellum. It could be Bellum. And then there's Mark Hamill. Could it be? Bellum is notorious for his Star Wars gameplay. Mark Hamill has a beard. It is confirmed. Mark Hamill also has that weathered look on his face, like Bellum. The, the voice. You can feel the weatheredness in his voice. Bellum ends every one of his videos with Chow Chow. Now, Mark Hamill has this dog, which through speculation, I believe came from France. Chow is a French word for goodbye. It's very chic, it's very mode. Mark Hamill is also very chic in mode, like the French. And he has been known to say chow chow quite often. Could Mark Hamill be Bellum Total? I'm gonna expose you for who you are, Bellum. We're gonna expose you. Hello, Mark Hamill. And here it is, guys. Breaking news! We have him. We've caught him. After saying, hello, Mark Hamill, Bellum responded, yes, you've caught me. I am Mark Hamill. God damn it. This is all my life's work. We've got him. We got him. God damn it. We got him.